So in today's video, we are going to talk about using the Godox S30 as a portable key light on set during my short film, The Decommissioning, and we'll get into it more after this. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. And if you're new here, my name is Jeff Fagan. I'm a filmmaker and DP based out of South Florida. And in today's video, we are talking about using the Godox S30 light as a key light, specifically on my short film that I premiered on this channel called The Decommissioning. Now, the reason we use the Godox S30 as our portable key light, although its output is only in total 30 watts, is due to the fact that it can actually be powered portably via Sony NPF batteries here on the side of the unit. This light has a proprietary mount that you could see here on the front of the unit. And when you pair it with the special SA30 softbox that Godox makes for this light, in certain situations, this can be a really powerful, small and portable key light. Now again, this light only outputs 30 watts, and when you're powering it through the Sony MPF battery, you're not actually getting the entire 30 watts either. However, depending on how far away you are from the subject, if you are using this as a portable light, that may not entirely be a big problem. Now on set, what we did was we had the SA30 softbox on the S30 light, and we actually attached the light to a monopod. And on the monopod, we had a little lighting attachment so we could properly attach the light to the monopod itself. Having the MPF battery here on the side with the small little wire that goes from the plate to the light made it really possible and very easy to keep this thing tight and compact. We had the light pretty close to our subject, but it was always out of frame. In our case, using this light worked really well because we were able to get in, get the shots we needed, and get out, and really shoot that vignette in like two hours. Versus if we had to do a lighting setup every single time for a very simple vignette like that, probably would have taken us all day. So I am very happy that I have this in my kit. I'm pretty much bringing it with me to most of my shoots now, just because of the sheer size. Again, this light is really small. And a lot of the times I don't use it, but I keep it in the kit for the times like in the decommissioning where having it is a great asset. So I don't recommend this for all shoots to be used as a portable key light, but in certain situations, this light can really work wonders for you. Especially in the times we're in now where when you're on set, you need to be quicker and smarter on how you're working using this can really help. So I do recommend it again for certain situations. And if you guys have any questions that I didn't go over, one, I did a full review on this light about a year ago, which I'll link in the description below. And any questions that I didn't go over in this video or that video, please feel free to put them in the comments below and I'll get to them as I see them. And yeah, that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little bit of using the Godox S30 as a key light on the decommissioning. And I'll see you guys in the next video.